Welcome back, family. We're getting ready to run inside CVS to do our, um, I was going to say overnight haul, but it's not. Our 820 to 827 Sunday afternoon at CVS haul. I think we're going to try and top the one we did the last week, which was a massive haul. We shall see. We're going to talk 20 off 80, 10 off 60, maybe 10 off 70. Um, we're going to talk about a few options for the spend 40 scenario. So stay tuned for those. We've got great you by Kotex deals and some other great stuff. So let's get started. And please, you guys, hit the like button. I'm begging you, please hit the like button. Neutrogena Cosmetics. This week, I buy two, get back a $6 extra buck, and we're going to be using a double CRTs. We're going to use our $3 CRT that we got last week, and then everybody this week also got another $3 CRT, so this is really exciting. Now, on our live this morning, we talked about these. Why are these only cosmetics in cap? Because they're not cosmetics, and they're not putting back extra bucks. I had my cashier scan them. They're not getting back extra bucks. They, these should not be on the end cap with cosmetics. Do not get those. What we're going to grab, all they have is this item for $6.79, then a larger one for $11.79. These two bring us to $18.58. We're going to be using, like I said, our $3 CRT from last week that we have printed, plus our instant CRT that everybody got this week for $3. And we're going to be using two $3 manufacturer coupons um, from coupons.com, or you could use one printable and one one digital so if we were to do this deal by itself we would pay 658 getting back six dollars in extra bucks final cost would be just 58 cents total for the bowl that's a great price but we're going to be pairing this in with some other Good stuff much. to get it even cheaper now we're going to be working on our first to spend 40 get back a 10 dollar extra buck deal i'm so excited about this deal you guys so the scott paper towels are included six equals 10 roll they are 5.99 so we're going to pick up one pack of these and like we talked about on live i don't know where this four dollar scott paper towel crt came from but y'all i got one so we're going to use that with a one dollar digital coupon pairing in with our scott we're going to be grabbing the downy unstoppables because we have some hot you guys really hot ibotta off so we're going to pick up five of the unstoppables that are 8.6 ounce price $6.99. We're going to be using five of our $2 printable coupons from pggoodeveryday.com or you can guys or you guys can grab a set of them from the Instagram Ferry. We also have a $2 digital coupon. If you cannot use five in mixing and matching, if you cannot use five total, what you can do is um, mix and match between the $6.99 items and the downies that are $5.49. Just make sure though you're at $40 or the 98% rule worth of 40 bucks. We have Ibotta offers for the $6.99. We've got Ibotta offers for the $5.49. So here's our spin 40 deal right here, the paper towels and then the five 8.6 ounce downy. We're at $40.94, but we're taking off $2 in coupons for each one of our downy, a dollar digital for our Scott, a $4 Scott paper towels CRT. That'll bring us down to $25.94, getting back $10, but we would be getting back $2.75 on Ibotta for each downy, you guys. Now, that'll give us back a total of $13.75 on Ibotta. Now our final cost is $2.19 total for all items or 36 cents per item. But since we've got like 41 bucks here and we're not using any spend threshold CRTs, our $4 Scott CRT is not a spend threshold. It's just $4 off Scott paper towels. We're going to pair this in with, you guys called it, our Neutrogena. With the Neutrogena deal paired in here, we're at $59.52. We've reached the 98% rule to use a 10 off 60 email next purchase CRT. So this is going to be hot. After all coupons and CRTs, we're going to pay $22.52. Get back 10 for the Downey and Scott, 6 for the Neutrogena. That's 16 coming back. We're already at a profit. Plus $13.75 on Ibotta. Holy schmoly, you guys. I already know this is going to be one of my favorite transactions of the week. Worked like a charm. Worked like a charm. Even if you guys do not have the $4 Scott CRT, forget about it. It's still going to be free or a profit for you. My 10 off 60 came off. Our Scott digital coupon came off. All of our $2 paper coupons came off for our Downy. Um, $3 coupons for our Neutrogena came off. Our $3 CRTs came off. I used $21 in extra bucks and paid $1.70 of my own money. So $22.70. We got back $14 when I bought us. So I had a, I think it was a 15 or 25 sent any offer i submitted that and then 13.75 for all the downy and we got back 16 and extra bucks so this receipt was a seven dollar and 30 cent profit and we're submitting all of these downy to pggoodeverybody.com for 50 points each 
Neutrogena Cosmetics. So we've got our $3 instant CRT from last week, if you still have it, and our $3 instant CRT from this week. We're gonna stack and use these both together at the same time. Those are different CRTs, different expiration dates, different barcode numbers, you can use them at the same time. We're also gonna be using two $3 manufacturer coupons. So the cheapest items in my store here are these $11.29 items right here. Now obviously we're gonna be like well over, way over $20 but that is okay so we're gonna grab these we're gonna use two three dollar manufacturer coupons two three dollar CRTs then we're stacking on here a 40% off Neutrogena Cosmetics CRT now that 40% off CRT is gonna come off after all other coupons CRTs and extra bucks are applied so we're down to paying like 634 getting back six dollars in extra bucks these will be a final cost of like 34 cents let's talk about huge profits with Alme Cosmetics so Alme, spend 15, get back a $5 extra buck. I've got double CRTs on this account, you guys. I've got a $5 CRT from last week and a $5 CRT for this week. What is going on with the double CRTs? This is such an amazing deal. Not only that, but on this account, which is my brand new, newest CVS account, I have a 40% off Alme Cosmetics CRT twice. I have two 40% off Cosmetics Alme CRTs, two $5 Alme Cosmetics CRTs, and we're gonna be using $3 manufacturer coupons from the 86 save, these did expire 819. So let's talk about it, family. We're gonna pick up two of these mascaras at 949. This will bring us to 1898. First thing we're gonna do, we're gonna deduct $6 for these two manufacturer coupons. We're gonna deduct another $10 for these two CRTs. Now we're gonna take that total times 0 0.40 for our first 40% off CRT. Then we're gonna take that total again and times it by another 40% off CRT. After all of that, these two CRTs are manufacturer coupons. We're gonna owe CVS, CVS like a dollar family. A dollar, we're getting back five. However, I'm also getting back $6 on Ibotta, $3 for each Alme. So these are gonna be like a $10 profit. Sally Hansen products are gonna be buy two, get four, or buy three, get seven. And you guys, guess what? On my newest account, I've got a 30% off Sally Hansen nail care CRT and a 50% off nail care CRT. Yes, you can stack and use them both together in the same transaction. Now, I think the 30% off is gonna come off first because the 50% off is gonna save us the most money. Total is gonna be 12.57. We're gonna take that times 0 0.30, get our total from that. Then we're gonna take that total times 0 0.50 for our 50% off CRT. And we're gonna be down to paying four dollars and some change getting back seven these are going to be like a two dollar and sixty cent profit i will be pleasantly surprised if that 50 percent off crt applies first then the 30 percent off applies after that we'll have to see when we get to the register our cosmetics receipt with the nail care went really well i just decided to pair in all of these deals the alme the neutrogena cosmetics and the sally hansen together because all of these deals i was using percentage off crt so i just decided hey i'm gonna pair all this stuff together and pay cash just one time for these items so everything worked out fantastically look at all these crts you guys on here so all the items up top we've got our three dollar paper coupons that scan for the alme and the neutrogena then everything else was our crts that we've already talked about i paid eleven dollars and eighty cents out of pocket before tax but we got back $18 worth of extra bucks for the deals that we just talked about and $6 on Ibotta for the Alme. So we got 24 back. We paid about $12 out of pocket. This receipt is a $12 money maker. Okay, all my party people that have two $4 off two by Cotex digital coupons. How did that happen? I don't know, but I got that same thing on at least one of my accounts. So I'm excited about that. So listen carefully, if we want those coupons to glitch, our half off item needs to be at least $4. No ifs, ands, or buts. Unless you wanna grab three products, which would just be a whole hassle, it wouldn't be worth it. So we want our half off price item to be at least $4. So can we get this one that's $7.79? What's half of $7.79? It's not $4, so we can't get that one. We need to find an item that's at least $8 or more to get our glitch, and I found some. So we're gonna use these right here. These are a big pack and I'll be able to sell these probably okay. So these are $9.49 and buy one, get one half. Our half off item is $4.74. Our total will be $14.23. We're gonna use this three off 12 feminine care CRT 
and both $4 off two digital coupons glitching. So we're gonna pay $3.23, you guys, but we're getting back $2 in extra bucks. So these are gonna be $1.23 total in extra fetch points. That's not bad because these are a larger size pack and they're overnight maxi. So you buy Codex receipt using both $4 off two digital coupons that did glitch and come off together. They both came off. Our three off 12 CRT came off. I used $3 in extra bucks to pay, paying just 23 cents of my own money. Got back $2 in extra bucks. So final cost for this receipt, $1.23. Let's grab the same Almay deal again that we have already talked about. We're gonna be picking up two mascaras again. This is gonna bring us to $18.98, y'all. We're gonna be using two $5 Almay Cosmetics CRT. One is from last week, one is from this week. And our two $3 coupons. So with $10 in Almay Cosmetics CRTs and our two $3 coupons, that'll drop us down to $2.98, but we're getting back a five. These are gonna be like a $2 profit. Plus we're gonna keep our little couponing spirit fingers crossed that that three dollar offer on ibotta is going to reset giving us back another six dollars here now pairing in with our alme we're going to be doing a 20 off 80 crt so if you guys have a 20 off 80 follow along this deal is going to be for you continuing on with our 20 off 80 we're picking up the l5 this week they're on sale two for nine dollars we're going to be using a three dollar off two printable coupon from coupons.com it did expire 8 12 that's going to be glitching with a three dollar off two digital coupon so we're at $9 total, but we're taking off six. We're gonna pay $3, but we're also getting back $3. So if we did this deal by itself, these two items would both be completely free. Still working on our 20 off 80. We're gonna pair in another spend 40 deal. And this one, we're gonna be focusing on a lot of laundry care products. So I don't have any gain fireworks in my stockpile right now. Um, but if you'd rather grab the Downy 5.5 ounce or the Gain, make sure they're just 5.49. You can mix and match between whatever ones that you want, but I'm going to be picking up mostly Gain. Five cent shakes at 5.49. We're going to be using five $1 coupons. Now, if you want to grab them from pgeveryday.com, you can. If you want to grab some from the Instagram fairy, you can. If you only want to use a couple of these $1 Gain printable coupons, you can. And then grab Downy and use the $1 Downy printables for the rest. Whatever works best for you at your store. So we're getting a dollar off of each one of our products here, but we're also going to be getting back money on Ibotta. $1.75 back for each item, so that'll bring us back $8.75 total. This deal, we also need to pick up a 6 equals 10 real Scott paper towel for $5.99, and we're going to be clipping a $1 digital coupon for this. Then the last item in this scenario is we need to grab an item, a PNG item that's priced $6.99. So you could grab the Unstoppables that are priced $6.99 if you want, which would be the 8.6 ounce items. You could grab the dryer sheet if there are any of those are $6.99. I'm actually going to be picking up the Unstoppables again because I'm going to keep my couponing spirit fingers crossed that that Ibotta offer that we already submitted for, for the 8.6 ounce downy earlier, we submitted for that in our other deal. I'm going to keep my spirit fingers crossed that that's going to reset. Now, it's unlikely that it will, but we can hope, right? So one of these will be $6.99 with a $2 digital coupon, or you could use a $2 printable from the PGU website. Total for everything before coupons right here is $40.43. Now remember, we're using a $2 coupon for the larger downy and $1 coupons for everything else. If we did this deal by itself, we would pay $32.43, getting back $10. CVS cost would be $22.43, but also submitting back for $8.75 on Ibotta for the gains, and maybe a little bit more on Ibotta for this one, but not likely. But we're gonna get this even cheaper because we're, like I said, pairing it in with our 20 off 80. Finishing up with our 20 off 80, all for Breeze this week is buy one, get one half, and we're gonna be stacking this in just as kind of like a little filler deal to get us to our $80 threshold. So let's pick up two of these. Um, these are the double packs. So these are $8.29 for the first, like $4.14 for the second. This will be $12.43 right here. We're gonna be using two of our $2.30 for Breeze coupons from the 7.30 save. These did expire $8.12. Total right here, family, is $80.43. I would not advise you guys to grab the Febreze, especially the, the double packs just by itself, because it's gonna be too much out of pocket. But if you guys can stack in here a 20 off 80 and pair the Febreze in, that would be a much better deal. Okay, so grand total, $80.93. Now, after all of our coupons and CRTs we talked about, including our 20 off 80, we're gonna be dropping down to $26.25. We're getting back $18 though in extra bucks. So 10 for our spend 40 deal, we're getting back three for the L5 and five for the Alme. We're also getting back $8.75 on Ibotta at the least. 18 in extra bucks plus $8.75 on Ibotta is $26.75. If we pay $26.25, all this should be free and a profit, let's see. 
All right, so our 20 off 80 next purchase CRT went really well. We had to make a couple of corrections. One of those corrections was regarding the gain. We were gonna get five. However, on the last item, the $1 coupon said um, exceeds allowable limit. So apparently at this register, I can only use four light coupons in one transaction. So I put one of the gains back and I just grabbed a downy instead, same price. And for this one, I used a $1 digital coupon. So it didn't cost me anything extra out of pocket. Still getting the same back on Ibotta, et cetera. The only issue that I have with this transaction is I had two $5 Alme um, cosmetics CRTs. One of them, I guess I sent it to my card and used it last week, but I still had the, the paper version. It had already been used. Instead of getting that $5 off, we only got one $5 off, which is okay. So we ended up paying a total of like $4.50 for everything after extra bucks came back and I bought a, that's really the only issue though that we had. I'll let you guys look at the receipt. We've got a glitch confirmation with Alvive. Um, we have Alme down here. We have a lot of coupons on here. I used a lot of dollars in extra bucks family. So Here's the extra buck starting here. I paid only $1.24 of my own money, so $31.24. We got back 18 in extra bucks and $8.75 total on Ibotta. So I totally forgot about the Ibotta offer for the Alme. So this is going to be a freebie receipt. I just can't resubmit my receipt because I already submitted it for the Downey and the Gain. So just an FYI, submit this receipt as well if you're doing the same deal for that $6 on Ibotta, $3 for each Alme eye product. I apologize, I forgot about that. So final for everything you guys, $4.50 for the whole receipt, I think is a great deal. All right, family, I don't know how much longer I'm gonna make it in this CVS. This is actually my regular store, but I've never seen these two cashiers ever in my life. The one cashier is like intruding herself when the other cashier is trying to check me out and talk, she's talking over me and the other cashier. And like, I can't, it's too much chaos. Like I can't deal with all of this. You're making me anxious. I cannot deal with you, ma'am. And then she's arguing with me about 20 off 80 CRTs and, oh, you have to reach $80 after all your other coupons come off. No, you don't, lady. I know what I'm doing here, okay? Just trust me on this. Hit total and see what happens. Then when she hits total, she's like betting against me at the register, like mumbling, cheering herself on, like, please don't come off. Please don't come off. Yeah, don't come off. Like, what is wrong with you? What the heck is wrong with you? Anyway, Garnier Facial Care. Buy two, get back a $5 extra buck. I feel for you guys that have cashiers like this. I feel for you because my anxiety is through the roof right now. So let's pick up these two bad boys, $7.49 each. We're gonna be using this $5 off two manufacturer coupon um, from the 86 save. It did expire 819. Now, if you still have your $2 digital coupon, it will glitch with this, but I do not. But I do have a $2 Garnier Facial Care CRT. This is my newest account within the last month and a half. $2 Garnier Facial Care CRT. And I have a 40% off Garnier Facial Care CRT. After our percentage off CRT, we're going to be $4.78, but we're getting back five. So these are going to be completely free. So we used our 40% off CRT. That'll drop us down to $3.60, you guys. I got back five. So these were a small, just dollar and 40 cent profit. Select a Colgate toothpaste is spend 10, get back a $5 extra buck. And then there's another deal where it's spend 20, get back 10. Be very, very careful with your Colgate deals this week. For me, I'm going to work on the spend 10 deal. So we're going to pick up two of the items that are priced $5.59. That'll bring us to about like $11, I think in like 20 cents maybe. We're going to be using a $3 off $8 Colgate oral care CRT and a $3 off two digital coupon glitching with a $1 printable coupon. This is from coupons.com and it did expire 819. So after all our coupons um, and our CRT, we're going to pay 418 getting back the $5 extra buck. These are going to be almost a $1 profit. Let's talk 49 cents higher end crest. So it's going to be a little tricky like it was last week. So this week though, it's spend 15, get back seven. I'm working on this deal because I have a $2 off $8 Crest or Oral-B CRT on my newest CVS account. So I need to pick up items that attach to the $3 digital coupons that we have and that attach to our $1 offer on Ibotta. I can tell you this item does, that Gum Detoxify has a $3 digital and attaches to our $1 Ibotta offer. And the 3D White Brilliance has its own $3 digital and attaches to our $1 Ibotta offer. $17.98 is our total, minus our two off eight CRT, two $3 coupons. We'll pay CVS $9.98, getting back seven. CVS cost will be $2.98, but getting back a dollar for each on Ibotta. Leaves our final cost after that down to 98 cents total or 49 cents per box. Oral care receipt worked out really, really well. Guess what I had on my account, you guys? 
Again, this week, two or $4 off your next purchase CRTs. I didn't ask for them. I didn't do anything special to get them. They just keep giving them to me. So when I first started the account, um, I got one. I used it. And after that, kept giving it to me every single week. So here's that receipt. I applied both of those $4 off your next purchase. Those are not extra bucks, you guys. Those are CRTs. So um, we don't have to count that as our out of pocket. So look what we have right here. I paid $6 in extra bucks and 16 cents out of pocket. We've got a glitch confirmation with Colgate. All my CRTs came off, my coupons came off, and we got back $12 in extra bucks for the deals. Seven and five plus $2 on Ibotta for the crust and and a 50 cent I bought a bonus for crust as well. So this receipt you all was an $8.50 profit. Back to the good old Alme Cosmetics, y'all. Spend 15, get back a $5 extra buck. Again, on this account, I have two $5 Cosmetics CRTs for Alme. Alme, again, spend 15, get back five. We're gonna just make this easy. I'm gonna pick up one of the um, foundations for $15.99. And we're going to be using our two $5 CRTs, one from this week, one from last week, stacking it with a $3 manufacturer coupon from the 8-6 save expired 8-19. $13 is coming off of our $16 total, so we're going to pay CVS just 3 bucks, getting back our $5 extra, $2 profit, plus we're getting back $3 for this on Ibotta, making this a final cost of a $5 moneymaker really easy l5 glitch deal everything worked out fine i used a three dollars and extra bucks to pay paid nothing got back three dollars and extra bucks so these were totally free we're gonna do another spend 40 deal get back a ten dollar extra buck on another cbs account because i wanted to do one that you didn't need like a 20 off 80 or 10 off 60 to get a great price some of you guys might not have those so i want to try and help you know those of you guys that don't so we're gonna first pick up one of the packs of cottonelle the nine equals 36 rule they're 10.49 got a one dollar digital coupon that's going to work with those if you don't have that um you can grab some from the cottonell website or the instagram fairy we're also going to throw in the x because my store has no old spice deodorant spray you guys it is completely wiped clean let's pick up four of the x they're 7.49 buy one get one half off and included in our spin 40. For the Axe, we're gonna be using two of these buy one, get one free Axe product coupons. They did expire 812 and we're gonna hope our cashier keys in the max value. The way things are going right now, I don't know if she will or not. Then our last item for this is gonna be a $6.99 downy item. And we're gonna be applying a $2 digital coupon or printable. Total is $39.95. So we've reached the 98% rule to get back our $10 extra buck for this spin 40 deal. So we're gonna be using a $1 digital coupon for our Cottonelle, $2 digital for our Downy, and our two buy one get one free newspaper coupons for our Axe, taking off $7.50 on each of these. That drops us down to $21.95, getting back a $10 extra buck. Final cost will be $11.95, extra fetch points for the Axe and the Cottonelle. If that Ibotta offer resets for the Downy, we can submit, but if it doesn't, I don't think $12 for all of this is bad because the Cottonelle on sale is $10.50 by itself. This one worked just as planned, family. So $21.94, I used all extra bucks. I didn't pay not one penny out of pocket. We got back 10, so $11.94 for all these items. That's a great deal. So just like this transaction, we paid $11.95 total after everything. I repeated the exact same deal again on this account. Um, now this is our last spin 40 deal. We done did like five of them this week, you guys. Hopefully you guys can find something out of the five or whatever we've done to grab this week. I did the exact same deal again. Four Axe, one 8.6 Downy, one Cottonelle. The only difference on this receipt is I used a $4 off $20 Axe deodorant CRT. If you have that, stack that on here because we're over 20 bucks with four Axe right here. So that four off 20 CRT, our two manufacturer coupons, everything else is the exact same. I also on this one paid absolutely nothing. I paid $17.95 in extra bucks. We got back 10. Final costs for this receipt, not including the extra fetch points we're getting, is $7.95. That's a fantastic deal. And that does not include waiting around on all the downy 8.6 ounce to reset. Doesn't include any of the extra downy besides that first transaction that we did with the 8.6 ounce downy. Holy schmoly, you guys. Let me know in the comments how you think I did. Let me know in the comments what you grabbed this week at CVS, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.